Hey guys, how is it going? It is S2G and welcome to a FIFA 17 career mode player review. In this video, I will be reviewing Usman Dembele, the young talented Frenchman who plays for Borussia Dortmund. I will be doing the occasional player reviews from now on, just trying to bring different content to the channel. If you guys do enjoy these player reviews, make sure to drop a like on this video. 100 likes would be awesome and also make sure to subscribe for more FIFA 17 content. Do let me know which player should I review next. Also, for the sake of this player review, Review, the gameplay will be on world class and I will be playing in the A League so that I can sim through seasons as fast as possible. So guys, Usman Dembele started a pretty high rating of 80, he's of course a right midfielder and can play in a variety of positions. He is 19 years old and hence his value is pretty high. He's valued at around 17.5 million pounds but you'll be looking to pay around 25 to 30 million pounds in the first season and it will gradually increase as seasons go on. His potential is 90 so we will find out if he does reach his potential potential in this video. He's of course 5 foot 10 and is left footed. Besides that, some of his stats already are just insane and he's just 19. I mean, look at that sprint speed. 91 sprint speed, 93 acceleration, 85 agility. He's got great dribbling, 88 dribbling. Besides that, he's got amazing finishing for a winger. 77 finishing is pretty amazing. He's got the speed stand, dribble of specialities and of course the flare trade. 5 star weak foot plus 5 star skill moves, high attacking work rate and low defensive work rate. He can play on the right, the left and even in midfield he is just insane in this game and after simming through five seasons he does reach his potential without training of course i haven't used training at all in this uh, play review so of course if you do use training this guy could potentially get to 96 or 97 which is insane i mean look at his stats 99 sprint speed 97 acceleration look at that agility man 88 agility that crossing's good he's got 98 ball control 95 dribbling 97 finishing his stats are ridiculously good. He's valued at around 62.5 million. But if you are going to get him after five seasons at his full potential, he's probably going to cost you more than 100 million pounds. But I think it's worth it, man. He's got the speedster, dribbler, and acrobat speciality now, and also the flair trade. And with the five star weak foot and five star skill moves, he is a beast down the wings. He can cut inside, he can cross the ball. He's really unpredictable, and that is exactly what you want with a winger. The only downside to him is his strength. 48 strength is really bad and he does get pushed off the ball but he does compensate that by having unreal pace 99 sprint speed does help him get away from his defenders now let me show you guys some of his gameplay and i'll talk you through his pros and cons so one pro is his attacking positioning it was superb he was always in the right place at the right time making superb runs and i was kind of surprised at this because his positioning is only 82 but literally man he was making the perfect runs and that's exactly what you need with a winger making those runs behind the defense and he was doing exactly that one thing's for sure he is a team player he links up so well with his teammate and he also plays those one two passes with his teammate which are just beautiful to watch and he creates a lot of chances as well i really liked him in this game also his finishing is pretty decent it's 90 he's got 97 finishing but it didn't seem that good i was missing a few chances here and there with usman dembele but that's probably because of his short power being low but he's still a pretty good player and here as you can see he plays in a great through ball down to i think anthony martial who cuts it back into usman dembele who does miss and as I said I wasn't overly impressed with his finishing probably down to the fact that his short power is pretty low of course for a 90 rated player and as you can see he played here a fantastic pass into the striker who did score his passing is just superb I loved his passing as I said he links up really well with his teammates and probably that's why his passing is so good besides that his pace man if he's on the run no one is catching him unless the defender of course uses his strength and pushes the player off but if he's just gotten away from the defender there is is no catching him as you can see in these clips he is just using his space another thing even with all that speed he always feels in control of the ball even when you take long touches you feel like you have the ball and you're dribbling with him he's just insane his ball control dribbling is just superb definitely one of his pros another thing the fact that he's got five star weak foot means you're, you can be really unpredictable with him you can cut inside you can of course cross the ball and he's just insane in this game again he's making a really good run here fights the defender to get the ball and then he plays a really good one to down to Angel Correa who cuts it back into him and then of course Dembele does actually miss this chance but then Anthony Martial on the rebound does score as I said he is just superb especially at dribbling another pro of Usman Dembele is the fact that he's got five star skill moves now I don't really use that many skill moves so it was kind of irrelevant for me but for those of you guys who do use skill moves he will definitely be a joy to play with now talking about some of his cons one obvious one is of course his strength I found that to be really poor another one is of course his free 
kicks which I haven't included as a con but his free kicks aren't that good especially his stance but I think in game he takes them pretty well as you could see I hit the post or the crossbar from that position so I haven't actually included that as a con you might try his free kicks you might actually score as well let me know if you do score a free kick with Usman Dembele and apart from that long shots his long shots were kind of disappointing I mean his stats are pretty good but I wasn't able to score a single long shot with Dembele and then his stamina is pretty low for a 90 rated player I'd recommend you guys to trading him in his strength stamina and long shots to get better results with Usman Dembele I'm gonna give him a 9.5 out of 10 there are a couple of reasons why I didn't give him a perfect 10 one of them is his strength the other one it's because of his cost you know he's gonna cost you a lot of money in the first season itself which does mean that he can't be used in a lot of the lesser known teams but still guys 9.5 is pretty amazing if you can afford him definitely go for Usman Dembele he is definitely one of the best wingers in this game and of course that is pretty much it for this review if you guys want more reviews drop a like on this video subscribe for more FIFA 17 content and I will see you guys very soon with another player review video